My name is Lee Ringelheim. I'm the co-owner with Brian Michaels of Circuit to Back Lounge. We opened in 1998 as the last bastion and refuge for, for cigarettes and coffees and cocktails in New York City. Now, it was legal until the year 2003, but you would still be kind of shunned if you were at a bar and you were smoking and kind of put the cigarette below the bar. So we wanted to get one place that was kind of free from all, all of the... Um, the connotations that were attached to a smoker and give one one last refuge for smokers. My uh, partner Lee, uh, he sort of came up with a pretty ingenious idea by uh, separating ourselves from the cigar bars by promoting ourselves as the a cigarette lounge. And by doing so, we could even to this day we still be able to say we're the only cigarette lounge. I think in the world, uh, definitely in New York City. We found this place through my daughter about. Three years ago, uh, she Googled it and said there's some smoking place that we uh, that she knew of, and we got here. I think it's the uh, enjoyment of a little bit of vice in life that we um, get to enjoy together, and instead of having the family sit down dinner, which is always so contrived, we just sit down and smoke and have a few glasses of wine, and we talk for two hours about our day, and we are happy. I thought it was going to be developing as a, a nice New York bar where you could smoke cigarettes and it turned into a, a bit of a hoopla. The law that changed in 2003 was that no longer you're allowed to smoke in a, uh, in, inside of an establishment. After the law changed, we sort of became a icon for a big culture here in New York City for a lot of smokers. We are a smoking environment. The, uh, on our front door, it's posted, smoking permitted just to give people the absolute choice that if they would like a cigarette and to be able to have a cocktail, they could come in here. If they don't, there are plenty of other places that people could go to. If I'm looking for a place to go to a bar or something like that, I will specifically choose a place that I can smoke because I'm a smoker and the majority of my friends are smokers. Sin trade, I call it the freedom trade. <laughs>